all 55 to people, right? And uh, what else? What else? Is, is it it? Is that it? Yes, that's it. How much is this? That's 370. No, not 370. 370. So this also should be 370, right? Purchases here. We just don't know this figure. This is 195. So, but we know now that this plus this should be 370. So, how much is this going to be? 195. So, this is 370. Minus 175. Equal to what did you say? 195. 195. We are missing one more figure. Can you guess what it is? Interest. Yes. Interest was uh, 25. 25. So. Purchases is 370 minus 175 minus 25 is equal to 170. All good now? So we we actually studied control at now. This is supposed to be the next lesson. Learning objective three, right? Yeah. Control the problem is in that. So this figure, 170, we put it here. I'll use a different color. This 170, we use it here. 170. And uh, she was she was saying you put a bracket. Yeah, that's right. So bracket here. Those are the two things which we need to cut, right? Returning and closing. How much is it going to be? 250, 170? Do I have a figure? Yeah, I have a figure. I got it as 150. Do you know what you also got? 150. And 225 minus 150 is 75. This 150 is what? Post of sales. Post of sales. This 150 is post of sales. And to calculate the post of sales, we have four items. Some of these items we add, some of them we deduct. Opening balance add to purchases, subtract returns, 